This is the review of the Audio-Technica ATH-M30 Professional Monitor Headphones. Let's go ahead and get started, folks. I need a new pair of headphones, so I went down to Guitar Center and picked me up of the ATH, uh, picked me up ATH-M30s. They cost me $60 on sale. Um, list price, I think, was 120 which is just ridiculous. I've never seen them actually sell, uh, sell for that. But um, I really like these headphones. I'll go through a couple of features now. So they have um, a slot here that can slide up and down to adjust the headphone height. They have um, very nice suction. Um, when these are closed, you can barely hear any sound coming out. And then you open them up and you can hear a lot of sound. Um, they're pretty stretchable. I mean, you can get them open pretty far. And you can also, uh, you know, bend them a little bit, so they're pretty durable that way. Um, I really like the comfort when wearing these. They seal over my ears nicely, and I can wear them for several hours at a time without very much discomfort. Um, I did notice if I'm wearing glasses, they do uh, start to hurt after about a half an hour. Um, but other than that, it's very uh, pretty thick. Um, it could be a little bit more plush here, but Overall, I think the comfort is really good. Um, one of the things that was included was this quarter inch headphone adapter. What was really nice about this is that it screws into the audio cable. So you get a really nice connection and you can't even tell that there's two cables there. But this is a very solid piece, not going to come apart. Very nice to have. The headphones also include a uh, spring right here which keeps the headphones from breaking when they bend. So it's also a nice uh, feature because it lets you uh, have your headphones maybe in your pocket attached to something and they won't break off. Now that's also, the headphone jack is also one of the things I don't like about these headphones. Um, when I try to plug them into an iPhone uh, or any phone with a case, this is an OtterBox commuter case, um, they're too the headphone jack is too fat at the top and so when you try to plug it in it won't fit all the way in so what I had to do is go and buy a adapter this is just a 3.5 millimeter to 3.5 millimeter adapter and this allows me to plug the headphones in all the way and then plug these into here into the adapter and that's how I have to listen to music on my phone which is too bad, but um, it's doable. It could be worse. Um, another thing I don't like about these headphones is they have the wire sticking out right here, which hasn't been a problem yet, but I'm always afraid they're going to catch on something. They don't seem like they're too thin, but you never know. Um, they could always catch on something and rip off, and that would be a big problem. Uh, I read several reviews of these headphones, and these uh, cups seem to wear out after uh, two years or so, but I did look online and you can get replacements for them, so that's a good thing to know. Um, the only other thing about this cable, it, or about, sorry, these headphones, is that the cable is so long, um, I believe it's a 10 foot cable, um, it's so long that it's always needed to be bundled up somehow. It's nice if you want to have maybe your uh, phone sitting on an iHome somewhere and you want to walk around but normally at least for daily use this is just too long of a cable anyway that's my review of the ATH M30s please leave a comment in the description below let me know what you think of them uh, what are your thoughts and go ahead and subscribe to my channel for more videos in the future thank you bye